Hello so guys, today I'm going to show you what you can do if your notifications on Streamlabs OBS don't work. For example, if you have added like a lot of widgets on like alert box, follow goal and stuff like that. And those ones like don't work. So let's just add a random thing. So what you want to do is simply you just want to right click and just delete it and get it back on. So just go ahead and delete it and get it back on and see if it works out or not. If it still doesn't work out and still doesn't notify you, most likely guys, what will happen is it's basically glitched out. So to get it get back and get it unglitched, you want to go over to your settings. You want to go to log out and log back in. That's actually how I fixed my black screen and also my chat. So what happened was my chat was all the way black and it wasn't actually responding. It wasn't also giving me notifications or stuff like that. So what I did was I just logged out out of my uh, Twitch account and I just logged back in and it was just working properly again. So if you try that out, it still doesn't work out. What you can do is you want to go to general and go to delete cache and restart. So what will this do? It will just get rid of all of your settings. It will just get your settings back to default. But guys, if you have something like your scenes or sources, don't worry about that because it will still actually stay. So don't worry about these getting deleted. It will just save up. So once you try that, it's still not working out. You want to go to your Streamlabs OBS on the website. So I have it just opened up. You want to log in and want to make sure that the account on here is the same as the account that you used on the Streamlabs OBS application. So like you see guys, it's not actually the same because I'm logged in with YouTube and this one is with Twitch. So you want to make sure that it's actually the same account. So right now I'm just going to log back in so I can connect to my YouTube. So let me do that. And now I am connected. So that's simple. So once you're done, you can just try out and see if it works again. And what I suggest you guys to do is just close it off and just reopen it and see if it works. If it still doesn't work out, guys, what I would suggest you guys to do is you can go to like if you're using like a widget, you can go to all widgets, go to alert box and you want to make sure that it's actually enabled. So let's just, for example, add something like a uh, I'm just going to add something random like let's just add what should we add actually? Let's do, like, I don't really know. Let's do the member goal or something like that. Click on done. So if it doesn't notify you guys, like for example on here, it just says my sample and it's like, what you have to do is for example for this, just go to here, member goal on sources, double click. And you want to make a title so just title this you have to title this guys and you have to also add a and after so you have to enter this guys if you don't enter it it's not gonna work out so that's also what I want to say but now let's go through to my Streamlabs OBS what you can try out is once you disable this like we have these settings once you disable this you will get a lot more settings like you see and you can just test out how your things are so on your account for example let me try out test member and it will just send the test member and stuff like that so you can just test out how it actually looks like but what I suggest you guys to do is on here you want to copy this just copy this link over here go to add source and you want to go to browser source over here and you want to just add this or call this alert messages or whatever that you want notifications and you want to just paste it on here so just get this over here to your url and just enter it and click on done and see if it works out or not most likely guys it's going to work out and after doing that you can try out to uh, test your merch and stuff like that so let me do that really quickly now i actually did it 
now my browser source is connected to my URL, but I cannot show you guys my URL and you should also not show your URL. It's really important. And you can test out how all these sound like. If but if you get still a problem, it could happen. What you want to do is you want to go to like uh, your subscribers. I want to make sure that the subscriber alerts are enabled. Make sure that these are actually enabled. And also on here, just make on all of them sure that they are all enabled. That's called also a problem. Maybe it's like disabled on yours and that could be also a problem. So yeah, that's all basically the video guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you still have a problem, if you still can't fix it, I will recommend you guys to submit a ticket or just leave it in the comments down below. If it did work out guys, you can just also uh, leave it in the comments down below. I wonder if it worked out for you. And yeah, that's basically it. So you can also follow me at Twitter and Instagram. I'll leave a link in the description down below also to my Discord server. And you can also subscribe and like the video that really helped me out guys. And thank you so much. And take care of yourself guys. Goodbye.